I'm Ahmed IFL TV proudly sponsored by I've lost like 5 a.m. in Saudi Arabia. Gareth's going to get his buffs. Uh, yeah, thoughts on Joshua's loss to Usyk for the second time? It's stock rose. It's a fantastic performance and an amazing fight. Um, yeah, there was a bit of petulance at the end, and he'll get hammered for that. But that was raw emotion and disappointment and adrenaline. Um, he's improved. That was an improved performance. U6 is the trickiest fighter in the heavyweight division. I've said this to you so many times. Outside Tyson Fury, he's the trickiest heavyweight in the division. And Joshua showed improvements tonight. Had him 5 4 up after nine rounds. Let's keep walking. I don't want to miss yeah, this yeah. bus. Had him, I had him five to four rounds up after nine. And then Yusuf used all his tricks in those last three rounds to win the championship. And he's a brilliant champion. Um, taking the belts at the end and all of that kind of stuff, that'll get digested and he'll get hammered for it. But, you know, look, as he said in there, at the post-fight press comments, look, I've got the heart of a fighter. I'm not giving up. He's desperately disappointed. We saw tears from him tonight, tears of emotion disappointment in himself but he produced he's still the a-side he's still a great fighter there's brilliant fights ahead for him um, and I like the fact Eddie Hearn wants to keep him busy a lot of pressure will have come off Anthony Joshua after this believe it or not really? and I think we'll see him as a changed fighter and a changed human being where's your bus over here okay quick one uh, Tyson Fury took to social media said that He's coming out of retirement and that he could beat the pair of them on the same night. Your thoughts and reactions? Well, no, he can't beat the pair of them on the same night. I don't agree with that and that will never happen, I don't think. Um, because that, that just doesn't happen in heavyweight boxing. We haven't seen it before. Um, I think Fury beats Usyk. I think it's a good, tricky fight. It's a chess match. I think Fury wins it. Um, I said easily in our TalkSport podcast, but I don't mean easily, but I just think he's got the style to beat him. Yeah. Um, and the size and all those kind of things and the confidence he's in the purple patch of his career um, I think Fury's the number one in the division anyway that's fairly accepted but U6 brilliant um, and uh, yeah I hope he comes out of retirement and faces U6 because we need an undisputed champion we haven't had one since 1999 Gee, I'll let you go thank you mate cheers pleasure yeah, cool. my dad in the street against a heavyweight I've gone back to the dad. I've punched him a few more times. Five blokes outside my front door. Can you come and help? One hell of a fucking story. So stay tuned. Welcome, Team Everlast, to the Team Everlast Fitness Day. Download the Everlast Fitness app and find your greatness within.